He's wiping his sweats. He came in practice. I thought he was looking. He was looking pretty crisp, so <laughs> looking like me. Uh, whoever wants to start, where do you feel like you guys are at coming out of that game on on Saturday? You feel like you are making some progress. I feel like we're de we're definitely making some progress. Um, we're right there. We I feel like um, we could compete with any team in the country, and we know that. But we just got to do the little things that'll help us win in the long run. So if we get that down, I feel like we're going to be good going down the stretch. What's been the missing piece in these games where you fade late? Uh, just finishing games, just making the little plays, um, just coming together as a team. But once we get that, like I said, I think we'll be we'll be a pretty good team going down the road. Is it tough at all to, to kind of keep the uh, locker room together, keep your, your excitement level up? And it has been a little bit of a rough start. I mean, it's been tough, but the, I feel like with all teams, that's that's how it is. But we just make sure we go to each other, lean on each other, because really, like at the end of the day, like we're all brothers, we're we're a teammate. So we just make sure we keep our heads straight. Oh, St. Louis, uh, they play hard. Uh, they definitely go to the rebounds. Uh, they got three players that average double figure rebounds, so we definitely have to get after them on on the boards. Make sure we're boxing out, playing hard. We we got to play tough. We got to play great defense. Uh, move the ball on offense and just give it all we got. As a, as a freshman, what are these neutral site games you know, like in New Jersey and then, of course, go to the Sprint Center? What are these like for you? Uh, for me, it's just, just another game, another opportunity to go uh, compete. Uh, I treat every game the same, so it's just the same to me. Montavious comes back and play this week. How, how will that help everybody? I think it'll help us a lot. It'll give us more depth, so that'll definitely be a good thing uh, that we need. Come off. Play great. He plays great defense. It'll really help us, and also he can crash the glass. So that's definitely going to help us this weekend. How different has life been for you without him having to step up and play a little bit more? I mean, it's always good to have like another player, another big that plays your same position, so give you a break or what, whatever. But um, it's definitely going to help us. Like I said, this weekend, and for me, I'm I'm still going to play the same, play hard, and then he's going to do the same, so I think it'll really help to seem a lot. Has it allowed you to maybe accelerate your your progress a little, though, because it's, it's been more minutes for you? I mean, I have played a lot more. Uh, it has helped me a lot. I, I've seen a drastic change from the beginning of the season to where I am right now, but I think um, him coming in still be good for us. Wrapping up your first semester here, how, how do you feel like just in terms of getting out of school, having a place to do basketball. How, how nice will that be? I love it. That's no no school, just chill, play basketball. That's like the NBA, so got to love that. Have you, have you had to lean on some of the older guys to kind of like get through this this tough part as you, you do wrap up the, the semester and things like that? Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's been a stressful week just like with basketball. We practice in the morning, then come back, do weight shooting, then get more shooting at night. So like, it's been it's definitely been stressful, but uh, they just encouraged me, telling me I got it, and then also preparing for the, the game this Saturday, while taking all these tests, doing got to be certain places. So it's definitely stressful, but I feel like uh, the older guys are there to support us. We've got a lot of advice, so it's really helped me get through this week. What's your toughest final? What's your toughest final? Toughest final? Uh. Probably math. I hate math. <laughs> How did you perceive Monty's handling this time away, you know, from the court? Has it been tough on him or has been patient with it? Just what are your feelings? Uh, he's been very patient. He's, he's kept his head up. Uh, he's been practicing really well lately. He just got back in a couple of days ago, so I feel like uh, his recovery went well and he's been pushing himself, so I think he's going to do great when he gets back. How has Coach been challenging not only you, but all of the bigs in practice this week? Uh, this week? Uh, he wants us to be better at finishing, finishing around the rim, uh, guarding down, re definitely rebounding because we got a big challenge this week. Just uh, like last week, we had a big challenge with uh, Perry and the other big. So he's been challenging us to rebound, box out, uh, finish around the rim, left le left hand layups, right hand layups, just everything, uh, getting second chance points, just playing hard. Where do you feel like the biggest strides are that you have made with playing as much as you have? Uh, biggest strides would definitely be my defense. Like when I came here, I was in high school. High school, I just played offense, straight offense. Didn't have to play any defense. But uh, came here, definitely seen a big, big change in my defense. And then also just um, the rebounding. Like beginning of this season, I was like 
three rebounds, two rebounds in the last three games, eight, nine, and nine. So I think if I just go crash the glass, it'll help the team a lot, Keep or at least just keep other people that rebound, like from the other teams from rebounding, that'll, that'll definitely help us. Is it just crashing the glass? Is it as simple as that? Because you went into the season saying you're a good offensive rebounder, but what makes you look that good? Uh, just just playing hard, like not being afraid of anything. I feel like that allows me to go rebound. So it's not like my size. Like I'm not as big as most of the forwards or centers in our league or just in the country. But I'm gonna go after it. Like I'm not scared. So I just go out there. Is the team excited to wear the lavender uniform? Yeah, definitely. Those those are fresh. I can, I can speak for the team on that one. <laughs>
this thing, but is it more on ball or help, or is it just kind of across the board? I think across the board. <laughs> he's just, you know, he's just got to take it, take a little pride in it. And he, we, you know, there's guys that have never been great, but they take pride and they have good habits. And he, you know, he missed the whole summer of habits, which we're trying to do now. And then now you get into games and now you're getting schemes and now you're going to guard things. So you don't get as much time to work on habits. So it's, it's kind of a combination of everything, but, uh, you know, we, we got to, you know, you, you got to see where we can go with him, and then see if he can make some progress. But we, you know, we need his his play. We need somebody else play make beside Cardi, and that whether you're creating for others or you're creating for yourself, um, it, it would help us as coaches. It would help our team.